What's going on guys? Alright, um, this video is going to be a short video, but I just wanted to update, I just wanted to clarify a couple of things. I, I noticed that I made a mistake in terms of the input mean and input STD. Uh, we used a, in the last video we used the default values, uh, input of a zero, input mean of zero, and input STD of uh, 255. So that, uh, using an input mean of zero and uh, using a standard deviation of 255, that pretty much divides all of the pixel values by 255. So that's one way of normalizing. But the thing that we have to be careful of is um, going back, let's see, going back to the retrain model, the, the architecture inception version three, actually, so this is actually a 2015, okay. So the model we're using is a little older, 2015, but they used an input mean of 128 and an input standard deviation of uh, 128. So everything was normalized based off these two values, 128 and 128. So since we use this model to train everything, what we need to do is we need to um, change the values. Uh, you could actually change the values here, as I did um, 128 and 128. So even if you don't put anything in the command prompt, like the uh, input mean int input standard, devi standard deviation, it's going to use these two values, uh, 128, 128, which are going to be relegated to the default values. Yeah, so if we use these values, um, you guys can check for yourself, but we get accuracy. The accuracy actually increases maybe by a half a percent or so. Um, let's see. Okay. So, okay, first we're going to save this. Let me just make sure I save this with the new uh, input STD and input mean. And what we're going to do is we're going to run again uh, some of the same pictures. So this picture, let's see, where is it? Um, this was the Barracuda looking image. So let me see if I have this. Okay, here we go. Image two. Okay, so this was this Barracuda image. I think last time we got about 98%. Um, now if we run this with the standard deviation and the uh, mean set to 128, we should get a higher percentage. So let's run this. Okay, so I'm going to run it. Okay, so now as you can see, we get a 99% and the notfish is 0 0.0083. So by changing the standard deviation to 128 and the mean to 128, um, you'll get a uh, you'll get a higher a percentage, higher accuracy percentage. So um, you can test it out on your different images as well. Be sure to change the uh, the mean and the standard deviation to 128. And yeah, so that's it with this video. I will see you guys next time.